For more videos, visit ForTheSakeOfEducation.com Alright guys, let's do this problem where it says a particle travels along a straight line with an acceleration of a is equal to 10 minus 0.2 s meters per second, where s is measured in meters. Notice that they're not giving us the equation with respect to t, but with respect to s. That's important. Find the velocity of the particle when s equals 10, if when v equals to 5 meters per second, s is at 0. So, you know that the acceleration is given by 10 minus 0.2 s and this is the formula to remember ads is equal to v dv so if ads is equal to v dv then we add a ds to both sides we get ads is equal to 10 minus 0.2 s ds all we did is add a ds to both sides of the equation so we can replace this with v dv v dv with this formula is equal to 10 minus 0.2 s ds now what we're going to do is we're going to integrate and you know that the velocity from 5 to v v dv is equal to the integral from 0 to s with this information given right here 10 minus 0.2 s ds so we solve the integral, we get v squared over 2 from 5 to v is equal to 10s minus 0.1s squared from 0 to s. When you keep solving this, you get v squared over 2 minus 12.5 is equal to 10s minus 0.1s squared. So eventually you're going to solve for v are you going to get that this is the square root of 20s minus 0.2s squared plus 25? So all you got to do now is uh, plug in 10 for the s and you're going to get the velocity. So when s equals 10, you plug it into this formula, replace all the s's by the 10. And you get that the velocity is the square root of 205. When you plug into your calculator, you get that it's equal to 14.3 meters per second. Final answer. Please comment below if you want me to do any problems and I'll be happy to help. Thank you.